You're looking at the Koi Pond at Manitou Park. The water looks green and park visitors say they're having a harder time seeing the fish. The city's Parks and Rec Department says all that algae makes the fish harder to see, but it's actually good for them. Bronte Saransky went to the pond to check out the water and shares why one man's not letting it ruin his experience. People from all over the region come out to Manitou Park to check out the koi fish pond and its beauty. But recently, it's been difficult to see some of the fish. Yeah, it's a little dirty, but you have someone just over here in the pond cleaning it up. You know, as we're speaking, you know, they t obviously take really good care of the place. Tim Goodworth loves Manitou Park. After visiting once a year ago, he was inspired enough to drive back from southeast Idaho and paint it. While it's harder for him to see the fish nowadays, he says he isn't letting that stop him from his art and experience here. It could maybe use a filtration system to help clean it a little more, but it's so beautiful it's hard to, you know, focus on one negative with all the positives around. Although Tim didn't seem too bothered, others on social media were. So we reached out to the city's Parks and Rec Department to see what was causing the algae issues. Parks and Rec officials weren't available for an interview, but they sent us a statement explaining that the UV light that kills microscopic algae went out recently. When in use, it leaves enough algae for the fish to eat while keeping the pond clear enough to see the fish. Without it, the pond turns the green color that it is right now. Additionally, a technical issue is affecting the pond's autofill system, and staff have been refilling the pond manually until a technician can come and look at it. The Parks and Rec Department explains that despite being difficult to see, the koi fish are safe in the now green water. Reporting in Spokane, Bronte Sorotsky, 4 News Now.